Guys, I want to show you how to fix this common error you find whenever you try to install Windows 10 in your computer. Let's assume you created a bootable device with, a, with your dry pen using Rufus and then you find this particular error that is going to display. You select the USB drive and you find this error. Error bias legacy boot of your file only media. So when you find this particular error, it's very simple. If I can say that this drive was created by Rufus, it can boot a UEFA mode only, but you are trying to boot in a BIOS legacy mode. This will not work. To remove this message, you need to do one of the following. If this computer supports UEFA, go to your UEFA setting and lower or disable the priority CSM legacy mode or recreate the drive and Rufus. Use partition scheme MBR target instead. So um, we're going to, I don't want to go to my BIOS and do some configuration, probably affect it. So what we are going to do is that I'm going to recreate this bootable flash to MBR boot to support this particular boot option to do that. I've already downloaded Rufus on this computer. So, so I'm going to download, I've already downloaded Rufus. I'm going to remove the pen drive on the computer I wanted to format. So I want to insert it on the computer. Um, so let me uh, identify Rufus, Rufus software. So let's get going. Sorry, this computer is a little bit slower. That's why it's finding it. Um, okay, fine. I think we are almost there. So um, let me look at my Rufus, my Rufus software. Oh, oh, okay, I guess Rufus should be here. This is my Rufus. This is my Rufus software. This is my Rufus software. So for this, um, for this purpose, I'm going to create the boots again, like starting over and over again. So this is what I'm gonna do. This is what I'm gonna do. Um, um sorry. This is what I'm gonna do. I will drag my iOS file here. This is my iOS file. And um, drag my iOS file. But in order to do this, I'm going to download instead of GPT, instead of selecting GPT option. So we're going to select MBR. So ensure that it is on MBR and the start the format and the crates. So it's going to remove, just click on OK. It's going to remove this particular error that we find. Just keep watching, let it fast and finish creating. See, it's still creating, it's just taking some time. Just give it some time, it's gonna create and it will be OK successfully. Then we'll be good to go. So guys, as you can see, it has finished copying. So let's remove the flash drive and insert it on this computer now. Now I just want to clear this error. So, so what I'll do is uh, I'm gonna remove the this thing. I'm gonna reboot it. So we we'll start again and see if we show this error. So let me go to my F9. This is an HP laptop, so the boot option for it is F9. So let's see if this error still passes. So I'm going to select the USB pen drive. You see, it say press any button to prove for USB. So I meaning it has already passed that particular stage and we are good to go. Oh, if you find this video interesting, please don't forget to click on subscribe and notification button to get video like this whenever I drop any. See you on my next video. So first step, I'm going to download this uh, Microsoft Windows 10 on my PC and um, after I've downloaded it successfully, so I'm going to create a bootable device using this my USB pen drive. So I'm downloading the ISO file for the Windows 10. Let me just click it download. After the download, they will create the bootable flash drive. So let me click on the download quick.